how to install unicorn in Psycho CMS. I am using Psycho 9 version. This is Sadish Kumar from SK Tech YouTube channel. Let us into the topic. So before going to the topic, I am saying one important information. Please subscribe to the channel. Then only whatever the videos I am posting will reach you automatically. Let us into the topic guys. So Unicorn is a tool which is help to synchronize template rendering content item uh, media item between psycho instances. There is a problem with existing package and taking package and pushing to prod or UAT. This will be eliminated using Unicorn. You can uh, put the package and you can easily roll back the package as well. So then psycho instance you will have you need to provide the Unicorn or ASPX. In there, you can serialize or sync or reserialize as well. Let us show you some demo so that you will get a firm grip how to uh, install a unicorn in Sitecore 9 solution. Let us into the topic. Today, I am going to show you a demo how to install unicorn in Sitecore and how to synchronize using in CMS. So Unicorn, this is a simple MVC solution. Unicorn can be installed using NUGET. Go to manage NUGET packages. You will see a uh, Unicorn. You search Unicorn. You will see Unicorn. Uh, this, is, uh, this is the latest stable version. So I am installing Unicorn now. Starting install. Now it is installed. Okay, Unicorn got installed. So I am checking the binaries as well. So MSR web console is there, micro chat DL is there, config DL is there, rainbow DL also there, and Unicorn DL as well. The app config we have Unicorn folder. In that we have all the binaries required for the unicorn is available okay so and so this is not if you deploy unicorn it will deploy unicorn but you need to create a config serialization config file where uh, this uh, you need to provide a predicate that is path of the cms template and content path so that that should be serialized with, with unicorn for that i'm going to create a new config Creating a new config here add an item okay, giving name of unicorn sample dot serialization serialization. Config here. Yeah, config is added. So here uh, I copy from one config serialization type code unicorn. This thing I'm copying from here. Okay, you can start visualizations. So I'm replacing this with this. And there's a predicate. There's a predicted data source and data source on page of this data source type. All the data source this okay. just copy the target data source as well.
but simply I am giving a data folder and just giving hard coding the path okay then we search for installation folder let go so um, I'm creating a new folder um, creating a new folder sample sample Path this it is. So using this path, okay. And it's a predicate, uh, predicate here. Okay, and config. Add to config. So what it is. I am copying from here. So, hmm, copying all these things here. It will take some time. So, here we will explain circle unicorn configuration. Configuration, you will uh, you, this is a project name in the unicorn. This is a descriptions. This is a de target data source, uh, physical root path where the serialized OML files are stored here. This is just a uh, type. Okay and the predicate predicate which contain the cms uh, paths for tip uh, sample template i have given the uh, site code template user defined path and for content i have given the site code from, from search content so if you go to the cms you will see uh, sample template i have given Sample template. I have given this path, okay, and the content I have given uh, this path, okay, search content. Uh, okay. Now, uh, this is the content path, this is a template path. This is given under predicate tag, okay the target data source where the UML file need to be stored you can give any path or data folder also Dollar data folder also you can uh, put up path automatically create a folder this this are the two uh, folder it automatically created and uh, keep the OML file what are the series file in them so I am just moving the package uh, to my website folder so I am copying the include, uh, include folder from here uh, I am opening so I'm copying entry folder contents and moving back to the solution for a configuration config site for pasting here. Okay, next uh, I'm conf copying the DLLs. Before that, I am rebuilding the solutions. Will be completed. So I'm taking the go to the bin folder. Uh, 
we will this in progress for right, this guys yeah we will this succeeded now i'm going to this folder for the next floor and taking the dll this move getting config unicorn rainbow dll and and uh, dll as well Let's go with this. I'm Config Mac. Okay. I'm copying this DLL. I'm being folder. So now I'm pasting the DL in the set bin. DLs are copied and on config also I move so I'm going to to browse a core solution I'm sorry CMS I'm doing uh, in assistant unicorn or ASPX So what I done is I install Unicorn using AnyGet and uh, I copied and I rebuilt the solution. I copied app config include Unicorn file and uh, rainbow.config as well and uh, DLLs I copied to uh, my website bin. Now I think it should work. will take pretty much time okay uh, you click here the link uh, when it comes loaded, so oh, asking credential, I enter the credential. Redirecting back to this. Okay. Oh, I forgot to include another config. And see, in searching Google, I found this uh, this patch config need to be included. This this uh, this patch need to be included for this as a hot fix. They are given for site core nine. This is specially for the site code name. So I'm already copy to your file. One minute. Okay. This config. Uh, copy this config. Here. Okay. 
so i will show you the content so this is a, a hot fix they are given from the site core side for this uh, issue in site core 9 site core 9 we have this issue so this config need to be included the simple config we need to include it for the existing issue okay so now i'm going here and taking the solutions Take some time, know the icon. Just initiating the initial serialization. Yeah, initial serialization done. I'm going to the Unicorn control panel. Now all my project are serialized here. So if I give sync. Perfectly synced. Okay, thank you. One minute. Oh, yeah, the resale is also serialized. And okay, start resealizing. Yeah, resealizing that. Okay, now we will show, we will go and see the CMS how it looks like. Uh, it is loading now. In the meantime, I will show you what is available in the sample folder. So there are the sample folder. There are sample content created. So OAMF files are created. Okay, search content there are OAMF files. This is for the content item. Similarly, uh, for the templates, uh, we have user defined templates. We have OAMF file created for the folder structure. Okay. Loading. See, on this template is uh, we are getting message. The item is controlled by Unicorn for this template. Uh, this person is user defined and physical path data is updated here. Is updated here. The so YML file physical path is linked to this template. Okay. So if you see the content part, yeah, this is also we are get the this is item is controlled by Unicorn message and the physical path of this content YML file. This is a simple demo of of uh, installing Unicorn in uh, Psycho. Thank you for watching this video. This is Sadish Kumar signing off. Please subscribe the channel if you are not yet subscribed. Then only whatever the video I am posting will reach you automatically. Good luck guys. Bye bye.